There you guys, how's it going? This is DB's pre-game, after-game predictions, post-game comments, all together. So let's start off with uh, yesterday. Remember that Steelers-Ravens game yesterday? Ooh, that was one ugly game. I'm just glad we pulled it off, but man, that was one ugly game. I was definitely a bit off on my predictions in that first video, but a lot of us expected a big uh, beating on the Ravens, but them second stringers, they showed up. They showed up and they showed us how it is. Um, anyways, we're going to talk about this game and uh, uh, the injury that happened towards the end of the game. That was not pretty um, and how the Steelers move on forward in this season with that big injury. Okay, so let's uh, recap yesterday's game. The offense, oh my God, that was terrible. What in the world are you doing, Big Ben? Throwing that pick in the end zone? My, oh my, that was horrible. Like, dude, we should have had a 14 point lead in the first quarter already by itself. I don't know what is going on. The defense wasn't doing its job. The offense wasn't doing its job. No one was doing their job. That's the reality of that. I mean, that was brutal. At the end of the game, I was on the edge of my seat and I thought we were about to lose to the Ravens backups. How? The Chiefs, they are the number one team right now. We're not beating them playing like this. You know that, right? I think a lot of you could agree with that. If the offense plays like this, we're not going to no Super Bowl. You got to improve on offense and defense. Defense has been slacking too as of the last two games. Letting the backups catch up to us. We had a third string quarterback from the Ravens last night. He threw like a 70 yarder touchdown right away to what's that receiver Brown, I believe. Ravens, yeah. How do you do that? How does the defense let a third string QB do that to them? I don't know what that means. Does that mean their third string's better than their second string or better than their first? I don't know, but, or maybe our defense it was just that bad yesterday. I don't know. It's one or, one or the other. But anyways, if we're gonna talk about Super Bowls, we gotta get on going. There's no way of beating Chiefs if we don't step up on that defense, you get it? If you don't step up on that defense, Patrick Mahomes gonna have that field day on you. He's gonna have them 400 yards, five touchdowns. You want that? That means you lose. That means the Chiefs are gonna beat you. And we're gonna see a lot of Chiefs in that Super Bowl a lot in the near future. And for us to prevent that, we better win this Super Bowl right here. Man, I'll take this Super Bowl. Even though it's COVID year, I'll take this damn Super Bowl. We just need to win at this point, okay? It's been a lot of years of not making it to the big game. Last time we won a Super Bowl was against Cardinals. And that was 2009. 2009. That's, that's brutal, okay? That, that, that's enough said. I mean, we did go to a Super Bowl after that, but we lost to the Packers, okay? So that don't count. But uh, that defense has to step it up. Offense especially, that's the biggest concern, okay? The offense is the biggest problem. Big Ben, what are you doing? Your passes are so off. A lot of them are so off, like like seven or eight passes yesterday. They were just, you're just throwing it away and literally giving it to the other team. All right, you do know what happens when the other team gets the ball, you know, they score on you, not the other way. But you really got men up, Big Ben, okay? We need you next five games. We got Redskins, Bills, Bengals, Browns, and Colts. If you don't step it up, one of those are gonna turn into an F, or, or two of them. The Bills, the Colts, and the Redskins, they got potential to beat us. They could beat us. You make one mistake like that, end zone interception, we could lose. But I'm not losing hope, okay? Yesterday was a close call. We won, ugly game. But us Steelers fans, we're used to that. You know what I'm saying? We are totally used to that. We don't like it, but hey, that's what we live with. That's what they do to us. 
our heart rates are probably at the worst rate of all fans in the NFL. But, I mean, it's us Steelers fans. We're the biggest nation. I will be back at you for a pregame prediction. It'll be right before Monday, which probably will be Sunday. So stay tuned. And DB's predictions, analysis, and uh, post-game analysis and news will be right back at you. Please subscribe, like, and comment as soon as possible. See you next time.